Okay, I've got this image here that I want to work with, and you can see that it's quite hazy here in the distance. So in Lightroom, we have dehaze, and in Camera Raw, we have dehaze, but we don't have dehaze in Photoshop. That's fine, because you can actually do it in here. All right, first thing I want to do is duplicate my layer, because that's just a good practice. Once I've done that, I'm going to use my quick selection tool and do just a real quick selection of the area that I want to dehaze. And that's just all this background stuff here. So I'm not going to spend too much time on this because that's not the purpose of this tutorial. All right, so I've selected the area that I want to do a dehaze on. Now what you can do here, because we don't have it in Photoshop, is go up to Filter, select your Camera Raw Filter, and then within Camera Raw, you can use your dehaze in your basic filter settings. So grab that, and I'm just gonna go a bit to the right, get rid of some of that haziness that I don't want. Perfect, hit okay, and there we go. So you see that difference between before and after. And uh, that's it, that's all you really need to do in order to do dehaze in Photoshop. Obviously you don't have to select specifics of the image. If you want to do the whole thing, that's fine. You can do that too. And it's kind of cool. So it's something worth remembering that you can do your camera raw edit, some camera raw edits, just open it from Photoshop for a lot of this functionality that you don't get right within Photoshop. And so I can then potentially play with some other stuff. All right, real quick one for you and have a good day.